Hey girl, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to take you guys to the stores. I went to TJ Maxx, Burlington, and Ross. They are multiple days smushed into one. And this time, I have to say, they had so many perfumes, girl. So get ready and let's go. This is more just of a walkthrough um, because I am planning on doing a perfume haul video. So that's going to be later on. But still, it's worth, the, it's worth watching because they had so many perfumes. Okay, girl, so starting off, this one was my new Ross, this new location that I have. They just opened. They had this perfume, and I will say that this one, if you love the smell of soap, this would be perfect for you because it literally just smells like soap. They also had a travel size of the Dolce Gabbana Intense for 20 bucks, which was kind of nice because I've never seen the Intense. It's always the original. Um, so that was good. And they had this Escada one, which this one is a little harder to find at times, at least in my experience. And it was 30 bucks for the 2.5 ounce. Not bad. They had this Calvin Klein one, but I didn't know if it was a men's or a women's, but I've never seen this packaging. So it like caught my eye. And then on this side, they had a coach that I've never seen before. It's called a Blossom. Um, I believe this is like an old packaging and they have a new one or something like that because I couldn't find it on Fragrantica. So who knows? Um, and they also had the Jimmy Choo Florel, which I think was the price was... It was okay, but I felt like you could find it better um, at this kind of websites like online. But it wasn't that bad because you don't really see that one that often as well. They had some Be Delicious for 30 bucks. They had a lot of these. You'll see around the store. They had so many of the, the delicious ones or whatever they're called. And girl, look, they had God is a Woman. This one I had never, ever, ever seen at like these stores. I was shook. I didn't buy it because it's not my favorite fragrance. But I thought it was pretty good because it's still being sold at Ulta's. And it's like rather newish for her. But anyways, they had this rough Lauren Fresh one. It was like a mini one. The OG Coach perfume. Um, some Britney Spears. These I have never seen. This one by Philosophy, Sea of Love, and Jennifer Aniston. I think that's how you say her name. The Thank You Next Supernova has been popping out a lot, so you would probably have a good chance of finding that one. More Be Delicious. I'm very curious about these. I've never smelled them before, besides like that green one. But yeah, they had this little like discovery set of clean. So just in case you were wondering how they, they all smell, um, they had this Jimmy Choo Blossom special edition. So I guess it's just like the original Blossom, but it's like a limited edition bottle because they did have it in the regular packaging, as you can see right there. They also had some Betsy Johnson perfumes. Oh, right? Betsy Johnson, I think. I don't know if I read that right. But I've never uh, tested out her perfumes. And look, I was gagging at this tiny, cute-ass little bottle or box of the Blossom. <laughs> and they also had the original Dolce Gabbana Light Blue. And this was, I believe, the Body Cream. So I was kind of shook because I thought it was a perfume. But no, it was the, um, because it was, like, really priced really low. But it was just the lotion. Pretty nice, though. There's a coach. I don't know why I taped it twice and that one too. I guess I forgot. <laughs> um, but yeah. Let me know if those are good because next time I go, maybe I'll pick it up. And I'm also interested in that coach poppy. I just don't know what it smells like or if I would like it. And then in the back, you see more of the clean. Um, but for this, Ross, honestly, like they have Jusica Tour down there. They ha it was a lot. It was honestly a lot because they never have had this much different versions of the same one as well. So I was shook. So now this is TJ Maxx. They had the Wild Rose, which was actually pretty good price. It was like 40 bucks. They had this little Carolina Herrera. And I thought it was a perfume, but I'm not sure if it is. Or if it was like a lip gloss or if it was a travel one with a lip gloss. Who knows? They had some Chloe's, the Nomad and regular Chloe. Some uh, Sunset Dream. The Sunset Dream was priced a little high. Honestly, not going to lie. Um, but they did have the one ounce. And also some Cloud. This was another day, same store. They had the Jimmy Choo Fever. The um, original Kate Spade. And these that have been going viral. They had a lot of, they had different kinds at least this time. Last time I went, they only had two. They had the Jimmy Choo Illicit Flower. The Jimmy Choo Lou. Uh, Clinique Happy for Men, Falling in Love, Versace by Crystal. The mirror is so dirty now that I'm looking at it. 
Capri by Vince Camuto. I've been interested in that one, but I have found it cheaper online. So there's that. Um, they had two of the, they had the first dreams or sunset dreams. And then the other one, I don't know exactly what they're called or the difference, but they did have both of them. And then I was shook that they had this one. I think it's Moschino. I love love because I've heard a lot about it and it was 35 bucks. Um, supposedly it smells like Dolce Gabbana light blue. Didn't pick it up just because it's not summer anymore. So I don't want summer scents, but it was pretty nice. They had a Gucci one and some more Jimmy Choo, some Moschino Toy 2. This one I've never seen, to be honest, at least in my stores, never. They're bringing back the Honey by Marc Jacobs, like always. They always bring those out and the dots but right now they just had the honey and then in the back there i was trying to show you they had a livia bell for 65 dollars which is not bad because i think it was a size bigger than the one i have and i paid like 70 something for that one so you know i thought it was a pretty good deal um they had some travel size of the very good girl and there's the livia bell again i believe this was a different day because they have that Victor and Roth. And they also had a Valentino. Which is the yellow diamond or something yellow. Yellow dream. I don't know. <laughs> um, and then this is the Burlington that's by my house. They didn't have that many. But I was shook of, out of all the Britney Spears that they had. Because they had Festival Fantasy. Fantasy Sheer. And I have never seen these at my Burlington personally. They had the Naked Fantasy. And the, yeah, those right there, as you can see. So, yeah, and they had Electric Fantasy. So many of her perfumes. I was like, girl, I got to line them up to get a thumbnail. <laughs> this just shows you because sometimes they will literally have nothing. Other days, if you, like, kind of keep taking trips, I go to the grocery store that's literally by the Burlington. And since I go grocery shopping every day, I pass every day. Not every day, sorry, er, every once a week. <laughs> so then I'll pass. See, like this day they had this It's Sunny Honey by Juicy Couture um, for only $17. You guys know this, um, these little perfumes. And then My Burlington also had the Goddess of Woman by Miss Ariana Grande. So this one is going to be hitting stores because I saw it at Burlington and Ross. So keep an eye out just in case you like it. And the Thank You Next 2.0 and this tiny as Versace one. Like, girl, I die for miniature stuff. And they also had the Versace Crystal Noir. Like, girl, look at that box. It is, like, literally the cutest thing ever. <laughs> they had Bella Note. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how you say that. I'm assuming it's, like, Bella Noche because it kind of sounds like Spanish. But um, I had never seen that one or this one. I think it's called Femme by Vince Camuto. Caught my eye. It really caught my eye, not gonna lie. But yeah, like I said, always check. If you have a chance to like stop by and see what they have, you never know. You might find like a little hidden gem or you might find something and that you were not expecting. And then this day they started rolling out the sets because you guys know the holidays are coming. So they had this set for um, Cool Water by Davidoff. Really nice. I think this is a really nice men's fragrance for an affordable price like this one is a hidden gem in my opinion that could cost you less like look at that 30 bucks and look at all the products but the girls get nothing <laughs> i will forever hate that they price men's fragrance look three three products but anyway <laughs> um yeah paris hilton jessica tour which um was way more expensive than the men's and they only have two products okay whatever <laughs> Um, let me see, how much was it? I was like struggling with the camera. Oh, it's 40 bucks. But either way, either way, it's less products, honey. And then the last one that I see there is the Moonlight by Miss Ariana, which these are a good deal just because technically you'd get the body mist for free because that's how much the single perfume costs, so you know. But anyways, girl, that is it for my video. I know when I do these videos, I just talk really fast and we just go through them, bam, bam, bam. But that's okay because I just like taking you guys to show you guys what my stores have. They were different days. Maybe if I had to guess, it was like four different days that I went. Like four, I've been doing this video for a while, um, I think. So I went like four weeks um to check what they had but like i said check it out i still i really don't go to marshall's there is a marshall's kind of close to me i guess you could say but i don't like driving over there so i really skip it but i really should start going
because they will also have a lot of perfumes my friend recently went in and she knows i'm always looking and videotaping stuff like that she sent me a video and they had a lot of stuff so i might take a trip once i do this video i like to do these videos like once a month and i have been behind i haven't um uploaded the walk through the store stuff but anyways i hope you girls enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up and i know i usually show what i get at the end from these stores but i will be having a perfume haul video coming very soon because i'm still buying perfumes so be patient with me and i will see you in my next video